Welcome to Regeneration 101, where we explore the nitty-gritty details of renewable energy. In this first episode, let's set the stage by looking at the current renewable energy landscape of the Philippines. The electricity coursing through the wires and appliances in your home was once a drop of natural gas, an atom of uranium, or, most likely, a bit of coal or diesel. In the Philippines, coal is the primary source of energy, making up almost 60% of the total power generation mix, according to the Department of Energy's 2022 power statistics. Given the state of our planet, it is unacceptable for dirty fuels to continue to dominate our nation's power generation mix. The need for a cleaner and more sustainable source of energy has never been more pressing than it is now. Take geothermal energy, for example. It's energy that comes directly from the Earth's heat and emits little to no carbon in the atmosphere. By harnessing this clean and renewable source of energy, we can create a better future for the Filipino people. To answer the call for cleaner and better sources of energy, First Gen Corporation's 100% renewable energy arm, the Energy Development Corporation, has taken up the mantle of powering Filipino businesses and communities solely through renewable sources. EDC currently has 1,189.34 megawatts of installed geothermal capacity from its power plants across the country and has been generating power from this 24-7 source of renewable energy for over four decades. But beyond generating 100% clean, renewable and reliable energy, EDC also strives to create a world that can thrive and flourish for years to come. By elevating its stakeholders, EDC hopes to build a decarbonized and regenerative future. The conventional methods of generating electricity from non-renewable sources have taken a toll on our planet and our people. Now is the time for change. In our next episode, let's dig deep into why geothermal energy is regenerative and an innovative solution that holds the key to a better future. Stay tuned.